My name is Teddy Chikainyako. I'm the head of the department for technical and modern courses here at Bedford College. So I was born in Ghana. I did my BTEC qualification in Ghana so many years ago. And before I came over to UK to study, and when I came over to UK, I ended up going to Kingston University where I did construction management. From there, I joined the Army, the British Army. So I was in the Royal Engineers as an electrical and mechanical draftsman. So we learned how to do road construction, bridge construction, um, drawings and all those good stuff. So with this background, um, after a few years, I decided to leave the Army. I decided to go venture into teaching. Of course, I wanted to support young people into their career and for them to gain understanding about the principles about construction and engineering before they go out there in industry. That is why I chose to come into teaching and I also chose to come into Bedford College because of the location and the number of students and courses they have on offer. Construction has always been with me ever since I was a child. I knew I'd always end up in construction or engineering. So even when I went into the army, it was still in engineering or construction background. That is what I've done all the time. And in the future, even if I choose not to do teaching, it was, I'll still end up in the construction industry one way or the other, or probably end up motivating the young ones into getting into teaching or probably construction as well. I think the main reason why I chose construction is uh, at school I realized I struggle memorizing with memory. I'm not very good at memorizing things. In construction you don't need to memorize things. You only need to understand how things fit together. So I, that's where my talent is, that's where things make sense to me. So if it's roof construction, I know where the various members of the roofs are, where which member will be placed, so that makes sense to me. I didn't need to memorize so many things in construction. Yes, you do need to know the names of stuff, but you don't need to memorize everything. As long as you know, it's like building a house. You don't need to know exactly where everything is going to take place. Once you can do the foundation, the, the next step will come up and then you can take it from there.